hi welcome back to my channel today i have a new video i know long time no see i have been vlogging but i have not been actually recording videos so i'm super excited to be filming this today um and as you could tell about the title this is my experience or like my story time for getting my first brazilian wax if you're interested then keep on watching so um, I'm pretty sure if you clicked on this video you know what a Brazilian wax is but if you don't it is getting your vagina waxed like the whole area down. Okay so I got it like let's see like five months ago my first time was in July so what made me decide to get one is that like you know the skin is so sensitive you get tired of the razor bumps and the scars and just everything that comes with shaving i just like no i'm not putting a razor down there no more like i just want a fresh wax so um i was watching youtube videos about it and i was like yes this i need this i'm getting it i'm getting it i'm getting it and like i was just getting nervous and i kept procrastinating like making an appointment so one day i just finally decided to book the appointment so yeah i was just scared i booked the appointment i got there my heart is being fast my friend brie went with me and i was just like oh my gosh oh my gosh and i think it's like the anticipation is what kills you the most even though it is painful and i will say my first one on a scale from one to ten it was about a ten i'm not even gonna lie okay the first time is the worst it is horrible so by me deciding not to shave anymore, I was like, I'm going to let it grow out. Because I didn't know, like, how long the hair had to be for them to be able to um, wax it. So, I just, like, grew it out. And then, so, when I got there, she, like, talked uh, talked to me, let me know what was, you know, going to happen and all of this stuff. And trying to put me at ease. So, um, if you have a lot of hair, like, if you let it grow out, they're going to start off with, like, a trimmer like to trim most of the hair off because you know she said it doesn't have to be that long so don't think you have to like grow it out so after they do that like and then they start the wax like oh my gosh Ooh, the first time because she ended up switching rooms but the first room she um the first time i got a wax in that room there was no windows it was small it was hot like i said it was back in july so i'm like just sweating on this paper like it's like a thing you lay down like the doctor's office and they have the paper like i'm just like so sweaty my skin is sticking to this paper it was just horrible so the first strip like it goes like this is a vagina it goes like across it wasn't that bad so I'm like okay this is not that bad and then once they rip it off they like apply pressure with the hand to you know take away the pain a little bit so that helps and then so they just go through just wax it and then I don't know it was kind of weird because how like close they had to be like fingers everywhere opening this and that and touching this and that and I mean it's nothing to be like you know shamed about or scared about because you know that's what they had to do but it was a little awkward the first time so when she started getting to certain parts I wanted to cry I'm thinking like what did I get myself into what was I thinking why did I do this I wanted to like stop her in the middle of it and be like never mind like I'll pay you but just stop but I toughed it out, I went through, I was like, this is something I want to keep on doing, you know, for the better results. So I was like, just tough it through, just breathe, just breathe. And um, one tip, it'll like help you if you like um, have a conversation with them, it'll like take your mind off of it a little bit. But yeah, it was just like certain areas are going to hurt more because of the sensitivity. And like, when she start ripping in certain areas, I'm like what i'm like i wanted to look at the paper and be like is my like is my skin like ripped off like you know like are my lady parts on that piece of paper they still down there because it literally feels like it's being ripped off i'm like Whew. and then the hot wax is not like burning hot but it does it takes some getting used to especially down there but like like i said I, it was painful like you would think your parts are gone down there. You would think something is ripped. You would think she took something off. Like it came off with the wax and the paper. But 
I feel like um, I recommend shave. I mean, not shaving. Ugh, no, I don't recommend shaving down there. I recommend waxing because it's um, it's safer. You get better results. It um, it's better on the skin. You don't have to worry about dull razors or like razor bumps and grown hair. So, like I'm currently, you know, trying to get it together. Like it's still recuperating from shaving. So I've been using like aloe vera with hazel and coconut oil. You know, just trying to get it to be like smooth, smooth, smooth. So this is what December. So I've gotten like five waxes so far i've been getting them every month and it's something i'm gonna keep on doing and when the hair grows in you notice that it's not as much it's not as coarse but by me i don't know this might be too much information i don't know by me being a hairy person it's gonna grow back fast for me but it's different for everybody but when it does grow in it's not as much it's not as thick and it's not you know as um coarse as it is so um uh, waxing lasts about maybe two to three weeks for me even though I wait a month because by the time that month com comes around it's not as much anyway so just like a few strands stuff like that and um once they they're done with the vagina and all of that area the bikini line and stuff they have you lay on your side put one of your legs up and then spread your like butt cheek open and they get the butt and that's crazy because somebody asked me if that hurt I'm like no that's the easiest part when she tells me to lay on my side I get happy because I know it's about to be over I know the pain isn't gonna be as horrible as the front and then like when they are waxing the front you will have to have your legs like in certain positions like the butterfly position one of your foot might have foot like she might tell you to put one of your foot like up to your knee you know just to make it easy for them to maneuver around and you know see everything so uh let's see what else i just want to make sure i'm not forgetting anything um it costs around 60 dollars but if you rebook it's 50 and i just found that i'm super mad because i don't usually rebook i always just call like whenever i feel like it's about that time so um you want to make sure you're all clean, you know, so it's a good experience for you. You um, you want to learn your cycle and know, like, um, let me see, when do I go? I think I usually go, like, two months before my, not two months, two weeks before my period comes. And one time I waited a little late, it went, like, maybe a week or so before. And I noticed that closer to your period, it hurts worse because, like, the, um... What is it? What am I trying to say? You're more sensitive down there, you know, so um, if you wait closer to when your period comes, it's going to hurt worse than what it usually would. So it's just all about learning your cycle and, you know, your cycle changes. So, of course, your wax appointments are going to change. So, um, yeah, like I said, this is my fifth time. I'm going to continue to do it. Um, I feel like I could never be prepared for it. No matter how many times I get it done, I'm always just nervous and, you know, a little jumpy sometimes, but... Every time I go, she's like, oh, you're not as jumpy this time. And, like, she's even noticing my um, progress with, you know, my pain tolerance and just, you know, relaxing. I feel like it's all about relaxing. Um, it's not the end of the world. Yes, it's painful, but it's not the end of the world. It's going to go by so fast, especially once you keep going. Like, my first appointment, I was in there for, like, 30, 40 minutes. Second, and third, fourth is like 15 or 20 minutes max. So the more you keep, the more you go, like the less it's gonna hurt and the quicker the process is gonna be. So you're gonna be like, it's gonna make you keep, it's gonna make you wanting to keep going because it's gonna get easier each time. So um, I hope I didn't leave out anything. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, so that is my experience getting my first Brazilian wax. Um, I love that I started getting it done, getting them done. I'm going to keep getting them done. So, um, yeah, I hope you found this video helpful or whatever. So give me a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.